time for some Frozen. It's gonna be awesome. Can I wait to see Anna and Elsa? Side of the frozen queue line so you enter in from over there and then you kind of come around here you know you do all this and then you go inside there and then you come around and the station is right here the exit area is pretty much right next to the um, I guess the boarding area
something's not. The music and the lighting and see. Oh. Yeah, but the music's the effects aren't working really. There's no talking either. <laughs> yeah, something's not
I just got off. For some reason, uh, like, lighting wasn't working, something wasn't working right, so I'm not sure. We even stopped at one point, it's kind of weird. Alrighty guys, I am now doing um, the Grand Fiesta Tour here in the Mexico Pavilion, and then after this, I might do Ellen's Universe of Energy. Here's the Mexico Pavilion. It's so cool in here. It smells good in here too. I've always wanted to go to that restaurant. Over there, way over there that's on the water. It's pretty much been on my bucket list for a while to eat at that restaurant all the way over there where you can kind of like see the actual boats go by. And Shay Carl said, um, he made like a quote where he said, throw us some bread. I think it was on Disneyland's version. He went by in the boat and somebody actually threw him bread. Uh, it was crazy. So anyways, I'm going to be doing Green Fiesta Tour right now. The line's very short. Green Fiesta Tour. Basically no line. Awesome. Like I said guys, totally no line for Grand Fiesta Tour. And there are the three Cavaleros. Here we go, Grand Fiesta Tour time. Yeah. <laughs> Hello people, throw us some bread. We're hungry. Throw us some bread. No. You're good. <laughs> Can we ask them for some bread? Can we have some bread? Anyone? <laughs> oh, the theming. There's so much theming. I mean, like, look at that volcano erupting over there. Like, you would never even notice that. So much theming.
Pero no. Tri caballeros, tri caballeros, de seguida puedes Y amigos, tomad So I think this would be an appropriate time to show you guys the three Caballeros in plant version. Uh, and they're also growing some peppers over here. So we have medium pot peppers right here. And then over here, if I do a little zoom in, we have just medium peppers. And so yeah, growing peppers right in this area. Your spaceship Earth at sunset. I think living with the land is actually closed. I was gonna try to get a night ride on it. It might be closed. So here is the Soren sign at night. Came all the way over here to get this. Okay guys, so I'm now going to get a night ride, or I guess evening sunset ride on test track. It's gonna be awesome. So I'm gonna walk over here and the sun is, you know, starting to set. So we see, you know, that. But if I keep on walking, the lighting is on. And I love test track with the lights. So cool. And it is, it is insane that I got a ride on this. An e-stop, basically. Not an evacuation, but an e-stop is what we got earlier on this thing. Insane. I'm gonna try to do single rider right here on test track. single rider is pretty short. I think it says 20 minutes. Avoidance 
technology disengaged. Displaying responsiveness to the wall. Here comes the final test. Yeah, I can't believe I didn't know about that. Yeah? Look it up. I should. Yeah, definitely. Okay, I'll look it up. guys I'm going through concourse B this time and so I'm gonna see if there's a big difference uh, in the actual screens you know and all that stuff so yeah so we're into town we are ready for takeoff the tribal societies on their kayaks or canoes they're exploring. They might be the, um, no, I don't know what, Pacific Islanders, I don't know. Say 
I've been to Paris. Yay! It's Epcot! Wow! Hello, Tinkerbell! Spread your magic! Hidden Mickey! Check out the fireworks, illumination. So I'm gonna try to quickly get over there because it just started and I don't wanna miss it, so yeah. I can't believe it's all because, I, I don't know, it's because I did test track and in Soren, but I'm gonna try to quickly get over there. Whoa, that's cool. Too bad we don't have the music out here. <laughs> Passing the Imagination Pavilion is closed. I think Ellen's Universe of Energy is also closed, uh, was closed today, like at least um, this evening, so couldn't do those, but there's a lot of rides I don't do when I come to Epcot, like Spaceship Earth, I usually don't do it. I don't know why, I can't record it, so why not? Uh, why do it? Um, Journey to Imagination with Figment, don't do that. Finding Nemo, don't do that. Uh, sometimes I do Living with the Land, sometimes I don't. I did it today. Um, I think that sums up pretty much almost all the rides, but you know, I don't, oh, and Ellen's Universe of Energy, don't usually do that, Mission Space, don't usually do that, I usually stick to Frozen, Test Track, Soarin', and Living with the Land, but you know, yeah. So yeah, I'm seeing Illuminations uh, right now, and the song actually brings back some memories when we did a tour, an actual boat ride for Illuminations. So I did a voyage um, over my senior trip, and that was an amazing trip uh, with amazing people, honestly, but we took a boat ride and we literally got the best view of it. But yeah, I'm over here now. I didn't, I barely missed any of the show, so I should be pretty good. I'll definitely get the finale on camera, so I'm going to try to get the best view right now.
we have Hollywood Studios fireworks going on over there, distracting me. Looks like the show's not over yet. Hollywood Studios, yay! Thank you for having been with us for Illuminations, Reflections of Earth, presented by Sonnets, a magical experience for you and yours. We wish you a pleasant evening and a safe journey home. Thank you and good night. Such a good view. Check out this view. I'm gonna do a little zoom in here. Every day it's so cool. And if we look over there, we still have Hollywood Studios going on. Anyway, so that was Illuminations. Is really good, but if you want to see the absolute best quality video I've ever filmed, definitely check out my uh, firework voyage for illuminations. That was just an amazing night. So yeah, that is that. And we have Siemens projected on a spaceship Earth. I think every night they do projections of uh, the actual company that sponsors the show, as well as you know um, just everything else. So yeah, the park is now emptying out. I'm gonna leave. I'm leaving Epcot now and check it out. We have Figment and then a bunch of flowers around him uh, with all the different colors. Yeah. <laughs> Goodbye, Epcot. I will see you another night. I'm leaving now. It's employees. <laughs> All right, well, yeah, that was Epcot's uh, Flower and Garden Festival, and it was awesome. guys so I'm now leaving Walt Disney World I had a pretty good day honestly I did a lot today I had over at Epcot did I do everything I wanted to do not really I mean I, I could have done spaceship Earth Ellen's universe of energy mission space could have checked out the wonders of life pavilion since it, it's open for the uh, uh, flower and garden festival I could have checked out more of world showcase there's a lot more I could have done if I planned a little bit better but you know what that's you know that's okay I'll, I'll come back there's you know plenty of time to come back and check it all out. So anyways, thanks for watching. Definitely make sure to subscribe and like for more content. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Alrighty guys, I'm now passing Disney Springs and you should be able to see characters in flight over there at night. Very cool. I'm now passing Volcano Bay and there's like red blinking lights at the top of many of the slide structures which uh, I'm wondering if they're testing right now. I mean, they may be. They've been working like all day and all night lately. So, you know, you never know. It could be testing. Orlando, my favorite city. Yeah.